Master. Little James. May I have a moment? Of course. I am. Um, forgive me, I'm uh, not always confident to speak. Slow to speak. It's a very good quality. <clears throat> I wanted to ask you a question. Please? So you're sending us out with the ability to heal the sick and lame. Yes, that, that is what you said. Yes. So you're telling me that I have the ability to heal. <laughs> Forgive me, I just find that difficult to imagine with my condition, which you haven't healed. Do you want to be healed? Uh, yes, uh, of course, if, if that's possible. I think you've seen enough to know it's possible. Then why haven't you? Because I trust you. What? My body's been broken. Since the day I was born Been looking for a healer To take my pain To take my scorn And now that I've found you I've beheld the works Your hands have done For everyone Little James Precious little James I need you to listen to me very carefully because what I'm going to say defines your whole life to this point and will define the rest of your life. In the Father's will, I could heal you right now. And you'd have a good story to tell, yes? Yes, that you do miracles. And that's a good story. You called me to greatness told me I could heal just like you But I don't know how to take this It's too big a burden for my shoes You say that I'm worthy But you've yet to take the time to heal me Then you say But there are already dozens who can tell that story And there will be hundreds more even thousands. But think of the story that you have, especially in this journey to come, if I don't heal you. To know how to proclaim that you still praise God in spite of this. To know how to focus on all that matters, so much more than the body. To show people that you can be patient with your suffering here on earth, because you know you'll spend eternity with no suffering. Not everyone can understand that. How many people do you think the Father and I trust this with? Hmm? Not many. My child, my precious child, I know that I can trust your heart. I'm writing your story That may be hard to see But there's power underneath your scars If you can hold on a little longer With faithfulness and enduring well Oh, what a story Oh, what a story you'll have the others, there's so much more. So much more what? I don't know. Stronger? Better at this? James, I love you. But I don't want to hear that ever again. I know how easy it is to say the Song of David that I fearfully and wonderfully made. But it doesn't make this any easier. And in this group, it doesn't make me feel 
like any less of a burden. A burden? <laughs> First of all, it is far easier to deal with your slow walking than it is to deal with Simon's temper. <laughs> Trust me. Are you fast? Do you look impressive when you walk? Maybe not. I could take away your weakness Right here, right now, make you whole You will still proclaim me There's a little more for you in the store I see your worry But your faith in me will not go unseen Just believe Cause my But child, these are things a father doesn't care about You are going to do more for me than most people ever dream. So many people need healing in order to believe in me. Or they need healing because their hearts are so sick. That doesn't apply to you. And many are healed or not healed because the Father in Heaven has a plan for them which may be a mystery. And we remember what Job said. The Lord gives, and the Lord takes away. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Is my child, my precious child, I know that I can trust your heart. We're writing your story, that may be hard to see, but there's power underneath your scars. Can hold on a little longer with faith in me and endure it will. Oh, what a story! Oh, what a story! Isaiah promises you will leap like a deer. Your reward will be great. So hold on a little longer. And when you discover yourself finding true strength because of your weakness, and when you do great things in my name, in spite of this, the impact will last for generations. Do you understand? Yes. Thank you, Master. A man like you, healing others. Oh, what a sight. I can't wait to hear your stories when you return. Shalom, my son. Shalom. And James. Remember. You will be healed. It's only a matter of time. Oh, what a story will have